This is Monday, the 19th of July. This is this cure lot I have here in Longview. This is where I sprayed the custom blend of herbicide, uh, glyphosate, 2,4-D, and a surfactant. Same thing I use at my farm. Got a decent kill. Usually I have to spray this two to three times a year. And even with the fairly heavy dosage, you can see right here I've got green. Over there by that manhole cover, I got green. And it's just, it's hard to kill. It is very, very hard to kill this stuff. And like I said, I got to spray two to three times a year to keep this lot cleared. Fence row around the street signs. This is adjacent to my factory. And I spray the parking lot. If you want to grow grass, lay down asphalt. You'll grow some good grass right through the asphalt. Up here I sprayed, same thing. Try to keep the grass and weeds eliminated within the lot and keep it down in the perimeter of the building. See here, through the lot. Up here is my factory. Okay, people wonder why I go to all this trouble First off, to keep the city off my rear end. Secondly, this is rural East Texas. Town's population about 100,000 now, but you got grass, you get field mice and field rats. I got some machines inside that building that are close to a million dollars a piece. I for sure prefer they don't eat the wiring. So I'm pretty aggressive with uh, vegetation control and vermin control. We got about three inches of rain here today. Here's this where I sprayed along the fence. Got to mow. You know, this grass comes up with all this wet spring and summer we had. Seriously, got the grass coming up. Building's 40,000 square foot. Uh, spray the full perimeter around it. And there's a gravel uh, lot for truck entrance up there and keep it sprayed, keep the uh, weeds and grass out of that graveled area. So, a lot of work. Did the same thing at my farm, uh, sprayed the perimeter fencing around the barns, the well house, outhouse, graveled parking areas up there. I'll try and get up there this weekend, make sure I got a good kill up there. Keep on spraying. Doesn't hurt the trees at all. And if I wait six months, all this stuff's going to grow back. It just, it's a constant battle to keep this stuff killed down. So I'm not doing long term damage to anything. I'm just trying to keep it down while I'm here and make my life easier. Uh, go around the weed eater, that is not going to happen. If I put an employee on it, it's going to take them the entire week. And that's not going to happen. I spray with herbicide every two or three months, call it done. My employees can keep on doing production work. That's all for this one. Thank you.